Hey, my brothers and my sisters, I just wanted to come up and um, share a little bit of encouragement and some watchman news here, but I want to share part of the garden first. As many of you know, you know, the Lord talks to us all in mysterious ways. <laughs> and some of us, well, and you know, in my case, uh, last year I had the hibiscus tree given to me, which I thought was amazing. Um, it was always a different color flower that would come out every day and I grew so big and it was dead remember that was awesome so this year I get a dead bush and I knew last night when I came out I saw all those buds out there oh, wow and I have a lot of flowers today in which case I did well they're all kind of a crimson -y orange color I'll take it they're beautiful I'm all right with that I've already had a few more strawberries and those are coming as well as the peppers and I've got some new things growing in there that I'm not sure of. And, well, thank goodness I didn't pluck these, right? Because I think it was the Holy Spirit that moved them from over there and put the seeds in fertile ground. Look how beautiful they're going to be. Now, if anybody knows anything about tulip bulbs, please feel free to share with me. I don't even know if they're worth saving. I found them in one of the pots that I was um, cleaning out for dirt. Uh, <laughs> um, or whether I should just throw them away because I thought I was kind of done with everything until what do my wondering eyes do appear I'm sitting here yesterday and I see these things coming up I'm like alright well I gotta till the soul of that but not today <laughs> so doing everything I can to just occupy right now and focusing on Jesus you know oh um, my I did want to remind everybody that we have the, well, it's going to be a super blood, flower, moon, lunar eclipse, I do believe, um, on the 15th and 16th. I'm going to leave a couple videos for you in the description box, and one of them is about that. I cares our time, right? So, we know what day the 14th is, and despite time is off as we know it. So... Then again, if y'all heard Pastor J.D.'s prophecy report from Sunday, oh my goodness, it wasn't my mind blown. <laughs> I swear I told you he's listening to my videos. <laughs> of course he's not. But hey, it sounded like it. I couldn't believe some of the things I was hearing. Uh, something prompted me to look up Naomi Judd's name and came up with bowls and blisters uh, in the strongest concordance. and. I reminded y'all that's in scripture and revelation. I didn't connect the fact that that's going to be happening after we leave. And that, that's how these people are going to be acting along with a, a lot of other things. But we're already seeing uh, people acting strange, right? So we know that we are to use everything we've got right now that the Lord has given us. Time her up. All right. Guard your heart and mind. Wisdom. Godly wisdom. The mind of Christ. Okay? Always. It's a daily thing. Traps have been set before us and snares to entrap us and entice us. And we want nothing to do with this world. Keep this world and give us Jesus, right? I think the, world, the rug has been being pulled out from many of us. And, well, that's because the Lord wants all of us. He is such a jealous God. That's an amazing thing. <laughs> I love that kind of jealousy, all right? He wants all of me. He can have all of me. After all, he gave us all of him, didn't he? All right, so then, you know, there was a rumor going around a few years ago that I haven't heard anything or been able to, you know, the Bible tells us to, prove all things and this is you know there's even though technology has totally increased to the part where oh my goodness it's in the amazon desert i'm sure if elon musk has visited there but <laughs> kidding but still um we had heard a rumor that somebody possibly had left us right um yet we had no proof so the video that I'm going to leave uh, shows that, well, all the upcoming 
um, things that had been planned for her have been now taken off the schedule and the sun is doing it. So I think that will give you a clue right there how's that without coming out and saying anything. You know, it's hard to be able to know what to say on certain platforms and or what's going to get us in trouble or not. So we have to be careful <laughs> amongst everything else. So, uh, well, I know there's a big hole in my heart as I am making last minute ditches, even on people that I've tried already to let them know. And, and you can tell, my goodness, I, I shared about the reprobate minds a while ago, last week. <laughs> and then everybody's been turned over to them. That was confirmation. Okay, well, I do believe so, and people have decided already. And, you know, there's still time. The age of grace is not over yet. God can do anything. Don't put him in a box. He's bigger than anything and everything. And he knows who's his. All right? Amongst all of us. He knows who's his. He knows every star in the sky by name. He knows every hair on our head. <laughs> oh, he just blows my mind. Absolutely, literally. <laughs> in more ways than one. Uh, so when you're... Just notice the little things. It's the little things, okay? Uh, just... He just blesses me in such little ways. Simple pleasures are the best. To me, that's a blessing. I don't know about you. Being able to get out and walk around after everything I've been through, my life. Amazing. To be alive for a time just like this. Amazing. <laughs> so, I will continue to keep looking up keep pressing in, to keep trusting, trusting completely. I'm looking for my blessed hope. Titus 2.13 As we know that Jesus tells us in the word that as he was ascended up and was taken and hid behind the clouds, we've been shown that there is a meeting in the clouds really soon, right? And therefore twinkle poof and we'll see you soon. Certainly, he's coming. Everybody's looking for a king right now. And there's only one true king. And his name is Jesus. And all who call upon the name of the Lord will be saved. If you just happen to come by, call on his name. His name is Jesus. Jacob's trouble is coming. Time of tribulation. Like never before on the earth. Please. Make today your day. To choose Jesus. Leave this world and give us Jesus. He's coming. Peace out from Texas. Keep looking up brothers and sisters. The King is coming.